Hey guys, I'm Big Mac Davis here, and this is being recorded right after Map 51. Like, I had an itching to continue playing Pirate Doom, so here we are again. So, um, what map are we on this time? We are on Map 52, Dead Men Tell No Tales. I guess they don't, but there is 161 monsters in this map. There are 10 secrets. Good grief. And 143 items. This is going to be a big one. But you know what? Uh, let's get going with this one. Oh, it looks like there's two secrets right off the bat, but let's do some more. Nice. So there's three, four, and five secrets. But there's a... That's only half of the secrets that show up in this particular map. But, uh, we'll do what we can do, so. Okay, well, the spinach from the last map obviously ran out, so we'll switch over. Can I go back down the stairs? I am not going down there again. <laughs> I don't blame you, Pirate Doom Guy. Dead men tell no tales. Dead men tell no tales. Well, that's right, my pirate friend. I will take those shotgun shells. Those are nice to have after that. Oh, some more TNT, which I don't need, so I must remember those two are there. And here comes the music for this particular map. Those are nice spider webs. And look, Doom Guy can just walk right through them and not break them. The cute little spider can still maintain his nest. Okay, there we go. I turned on the volume just a little bit in my headset because it was a little bit loud. I can't hear myself think when it's too loud. Okay, so where were those two secrets? Hello? There's a torch. I think the torch is the light amplification goggles. Where's the other secret? doesn't open, does it? Yeah, maybe not. That is weird. Although if I crouch, I can definitely see that there's a crack down there. I got an idea, actually. It's a while, it's, it's a long shot. Oh, gosh. No, maybe not. I was thinking... Maybe it could slip under the door, but the door is just a little bit too... Yeah, it can't slip under the door. The door is just a little bit too narrow. I do see something in there. I can't tell what it is, though. I guess there's no way to open it right now. We'll have to wait. Oh. Okay, well, answers my question. Just flip the switch. Okay. Problem solved. So those were those two secrets now. Oh my gosh, look who has risen out of the graves. That is cool. You kill them. They just fly up into the air because they're ghosts. They're spirits. And they shoot regular imp fireballs this time, not the, uh, knives. That is really cool. I like the fog and the, uh, animal skull, the horns. And <laughs> the skull on a spike. Isn't that not foreboding? This must be the Day of the Dead, a three-day holiday where the dead can come back to life to enjoy the pleasures that they once knew and loved. And they've come to enjoy it, but they, they see me, and so they can't enjoy it. Get 
out of here. Pesky Lost Souls. This is really quite cool. Let's see. Oh. Okay, he's dead. Good. Let's go ahead and lower down. Well, I guess it takes both switches to do so. Oh, and I got 69 shotgun shells. Would you look at that? Well, I had. It was good while it lasted. Uh-oh. There goes a parrot. Which means there's going to be a revenant nearby. Okay, so far so good. Pick up the little cannonballs. Speaking of which, I'll use a couple of them. Hello there, parrot. Now, those parrots are just the cutest thing, aren't they? Let's go to you guys first. Um, hello? Now you're dead. I like the uh, nooses up there. Someone cried out in pain. Or am I just imagining things? Nice uh, pumpkin there. More ammo, which I don't need. Let's hang up to. Hang up. <laughs> Let's head up to the hangman's nooses. And we can't, we can't squeeze inside the noose, which I wouldn't want to either. So why, I don't know why I was even trying that. Okay, well, let's continue on. Boy. A lot of hit scanners in this particular one. But it's not bad. Switch over to my shotgun now. Since they give us lots of ammo now. We'll grab these armor bonuses. right way, right? Because this just loops around, doesn't it? Yep. So, nothing else to see. Nothing else to do. Nothing else to grab. So we will move on, yes. Ooh, now we're in this swampy... Um, oh, I can't strafe because of the... Water is too viscous, I guess is the right term. I do like the music for this map. Kind of cool. Kind of fits. Oh, boy. Man, it looks like the Pain Elemental has a goatee going on. Gosh, come on. Water makes it really hard to... Straight, and I'm gonna die if I'm not careful. I wanted to check out that pain elemental, but uh, yeah, it looked like the uh, he or she, whoever it is, although in this particular mod it, it's a he, has a uh, like a, a goatee going on there. Kind of cool. Okay, yeah, we'll explore this side for right now. Uh, game auto saved again, so it means something's coming up. Holy moly. Should we lower down? No. This side maybe? 
Yes, they can. Which gives me an idea, actually. Give me that wine. Wine. Okay, now about the idea I had. What if... Lower this down and then get on it. It doesn't look like it does anything, actually. But this wall. I was thinking maybe we could get onto these things and walk up onto the roof, but it doesn't even look like there's anything on the roof, so. Uh, I had an idea, but work out, unless... No, I don't think so. Yeah, there's nothing on these ledges at all, so... Let's go back this way. Because I do want to explore the other side now. Oh, wow. Let's uh, thin out the herd a bit. Let's use this. Oh, I see now. So, one of these shoots out just one at a time. You see the ammo count at the bottom left? But, one of these babies shoots out six and does a lot more damage. Okay, there we go. That's a lot of specters, my goodness. Grab some more cannonball. Well, each one of the single cannonballs gives six. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. Let's switch to this weapon. How? Incinerated by a cannibal witch doctor. Well, that's not fair. I hid behind the tree. At least I thought I did. Well, let's try it again. Hello. Uh-huh. You guys couldn't do anything about it. Okay, well this time, I'll be much more careful with that witch doctor. Kinda cool, these, all these enemies have names. I'll be sure to save... Whoa, look at that, the uh, seaweed is actually moving. I'll be sure to have my uh, cannonballs ready. Wow, they all died quickly. I wonder why they didn't die quickly last time. Okay. Well, that's because there's more of them. Okay, well, fair enough. Now, where are you? I'll just use the house itself to my advantage. You just transfer from winder to winder. Oh. Hello. Goodbye. He may be dead. I hope he's dead. I don't want any surprises. And I'll just assume he's dead then. Grab up the cannonballs. Those are really nice to have. So, right off the bat for this area, this is the red door, which I have the red keys. So. So inside. Yep, he's dead. Good. And the game auto-saved again, so... Okay. So I got the yellow key that was in here. Is that all that's in here? No secrets of any kind? Maybe? Oh, ow! Whoa, what in the world? How did you guys get in here? Through the walls! I was... Okay, I'm guessing they're ghosts. Yep. Let's go outside. Oh, I'm locked in. Holy moly! This just, this just makes everything a little bit more tougher. Ouch. Ow. Let's get out of here. 11% health is not good. 
Hello? Bye. Any more? Oh, that was tricky. I will take that cannon. Oh, no, I can't. My health is dangerously low. 11%, 0% armor. Things are getting tough. Is there any other health in here? No, it doesn't look like it. Great. Well, let's continue on down then. Use more cannon. Cannonballs, I think. Oh good, there's some health right here. Whew. Okay, yellow bars. It's so black and white and gray, it's hard to tell, but I think they're yellow bars. So, right now, yeah, yeah, I think that's it. I think I explored everything that there is to explore up until this point, so. Let's continue on. Oh, boy. Auto saved again. This is a wide open area with a castle up there, so I wonder what's going to happen. Um, nothing good, I imagine. <laughs> oh, thank you. We'll grab this, thank you. And the wine. Whew, it feels so good to get wine back. <sighs> if only wine worked that way in the real world, huh? This looks to be a little bit like a maze. Although it's not really much of a maze. Another cannon. That's good. It's fun to use the cannons. Because they give you lots of ammo. I mean tons of ammo for this thing, so I might as well use it. You know? So look at the water coming out of there, that thing. Kind of neat. Okay, let's see what happens. He goes splody. They all go splody. We all go splody. Is there anything significant about this? Lowered down like in Baron's Lair in Plutonia Experiment. No? What the world was that? Oh, somebody was shooting me way up there. Can you see them? Yeah, you see the bullet hole. Oh, hello. Uh, we'll come back to that castle later. For right now, I want to do some exploring here. back and clean up the other hole. <laughs> yes, I I did just say that. Okay. Hello. Bye. Visibility sphere. Do I want to take it now or later? 
think I need it now. Why? Just, just right here, it lags. Must be uh, the software. Well, I could, this area is completely explored, so I will grab this right now and then head through the other hole. Uh, oh. Okay. What's the significance? This just raised up, but... Whoa! Okay. Well, fair enough. Let's uh, switch over to my double pistols for just a little bit. My shotgun ammo is not looking too good. Sorry if it seems to be lagging. It's not my computer. It's it, it's the game itself. It probably it, it's just every source port works different. Now that was a lag for my computer. It does it every single time I record. I, I I'm thinking it's a fraps issue. It's a fraps thing. That's what I'm assuming. Because every time I practice maps, or I play maps, um, on my own, like Doom, on my own, without recording, it, everything's flawless, like, literally. I can play anything I wish, with no lag whatsoever. As soon as I start recording with fraps, boom, it's almost guaranteed to start lagging somewhere. So, I may... I may experiment a bit with uh, different recording softwares well, to see what I can uh, come up with that uh, may help. So, I may go over to like, uh, what is it, like, um, Bandicam or something like that. I may try that, see if that fixes the lag issue. Grab that. Lots of little tiny openings. There's lots of holes to plunder in this one, isn't there? The reason why I stand back is I don't know if this does any splash damage or not. Let's find out real quick. Absolutely no splash damage. I'm a moron. It's just that when you see something explode, like a rocket, you think automatically, I'm so accustomed to thinking, okay, automatic splash damage. This is so fun, just riddling everyone with cannons. Who's shooting me? And more sentries castle. Oh, I can't shoot through there. And I can't do anything. I, I'm guessing these cages get released later. So we'll do that. <laughs> Hello, goodbye. So nice to know that it doesn't do any splash damage. as reckless as I desire. Okay, part's done. Ah, it just takes me back out here, doesn't it? Okay, let's make sure. How do these guys open up? There's gotta be a way in. There's also wine inside there as well. Switch. Yeah, sorry that it's lagging so much. I don't know. Really know what quite to make of it. Cannonball. 
balls. I'll take those. I will take that as well. Oh, the blue key. Good, good thing I went back. Uh oh. Thank you. Oh, I'm getting shot from every angle, it seems. I think this map is just so wide open. It could be my computer's having a hard time running it, though I can't see how that's even possible. But it probably is happening to some extent. Oh, yeah, I saw that up there. I was like, can this be lower? Yes, mow down my enemies for me. I'll help you do it. Ah, secret. I'm hoping this lag doesn't throw everything out of sync. I've had that happen before with, like, a long, long time ago. With older videos. It doesn't happen often, but it sometimes does. When there's an exceptional amount of lag, it will kind of, uh... go haywire. And desync. I'm not talking about my voice desync, I'm talking about the game audio with the video itself. So, I'm hoping it won't do that. There's a teleporter here, probably in case you fall off. You're annoying me. He's dead. Really? Just die. Thank you. Anyone else want to be sniped off? Yes. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, the drawbridge needs to be raised, so let's raise that up. Oh boy, what have we explored so far? Only one enemy left, but we're missing a ton of secrets and a ton of items. I wouldn't even know where to begin to look for the secrets. If they don't show up on the map, it's going to be hard to pinpoint them. Oh, I really, I didn't, I didn't mean to finish. I didn't think, I didn't know that was the exit. Bummer, and it didn't autosave for a long time. Ah, uh, I was kind of hoping to go back and find those three secrets that were just right there. <sighs> bummer. Bummer, 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 bummer. Yeah. Oh well, what can you do? I didn't know that was the exit, so. Ah. <sighs> Well, dead men tell no tales. Well, uh, there were a lot of dead men that I killed. I only missed one enemy. One enemy! I only got half the items and only 40% secrets. That's a shame. And I had at least five more minutes of recording time left where I could do some more exploring, but I didn't know that was the end. You know what I mean? I just didn't know. But, oh well, that's part of a blind let's play, I guess. You just, uh, roll with the punches. So next time we got, uh, oh my gosh, Baron Castle. This does not sound good at all. But that will be for next time, so until next time, I'm Big Mac Davis here, and I shall see you guys when I see you guys. So take care, everybody. <laughs>